Okay, so the last key that I press is shown in the upper uh, left corner. Um, now, uh, shift escape gets out of a window or, or that aborts, and alt shift A to get rid of the autocomplete. We're going to look at the atom directory, control M, atom. Okay, so stage one is the kernel, stage two is atom. The atom task is in Adam and Eve, it executes this at during boot. It compiles uh, how many lines of code? At this point, 46,000 lines of code have been compiled. That's during boot. Um, what that would include would be 35,000 in the Atom directory and then my own personal startup code in my account. Uh, anyway, so uh, the Atom, this is executed by Atom at boot. It includes a bunch of files. It goes into directory and it includes, uh, um, what would you call those? Recursive files? I don't know what you want to call them. Anyway, uh, so uh, what do we have in Atom? We have, uh, let's see, the window manager. This is one of the most important, this is one of the most important things. Uh, if you do a task rep, there are um, some standard tasks uh, used that are always present. The uh, You don't have a frame grabber. That's because I'm making this video. The window manager executes 30 times a second. It does a couple other things like pull the mouse, but uh, the window manager uh, updates the whole screen 30 times a second. This task is the current task. Then the atom task is uh, control B and we can go up and atom is this window right here. Um, he stays in a server kind of configuration. Um, his task inherit stuff from their parents. And since all tasks are um, children of atom, um, system-wide stuff is uh, associated with Atom. Like if if you give Atom some, you can get memory that's allocated on Atom's heap. His symbol table is inherited by everybody. So what that means is if a symbol's not found, it searches Atom. Anyway, so uh, you can also he's supposed to be a uh, like a server kind of. I, I've never really utilized this. Uh, capability but honestly I have a lot of things I never use um, let's um, let's make Adam say hello so uh, hello it's uh we have to I think this is right okay I made Adam say hello you saw that um, you can uh, tell him to execute code like I just did. Um, what I just told him to do was this. Anyway, uh, that's kind of like the crosstalk. You could also use crosstalk. But anyway, uh, so there are some standard tasks, a window manager and Adam. Then Adam, Adam's son is Seth in the Bible. So Seth is, uh, there's, there's more than one Seth, which is kind of weird. And Adam is uh, Adam is uh, is called the Seth task on Core Zero. Anyway, so where were we? Um, so the window manager uh, is one of the. This task is always present. the 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 wallpaper is uh, printed by the window manager. So in the window manager, what it does is uh, the way it operates is it has a it has a uh, a sleep routine which kills time now if you grab a window by a corner then what it does is it uh, it it's kind of like a state machine it gets into a uh, if, you, if you, it gets into a state and while it's killing time it's executing the sleep routine which is uh, let's see how many okay well, anyway so uh, 
the sleep routine um, gets executed lots of times. I think it does one thirtieth of a second each time. Um, now, where is the sleep routine? I don't know. Anyway, uh, so the Windows routines, I think this is all Window Manager. Here's the sleep. Now it pulls the mouse in one spot. Keyboard mouse handler. Uh, that's if that's if the mouse failed or something like that. Um, oh, I'm sorry. During startup, it does that. Um, it it pulls the mouse if I think if we check this routine, it's if the mouse fails. If pull if pull mouse do this, otherwise we don't pull the mouse. But we execute the I think we execute this sixty times a second or something like that maybe. Uh, Five hundred times a second. No, what do we, anyway, uh, so this is where the window manager sleeps. And every oh, 30 times a second, actually it's adjustable, but uh, it calls update screen. Now that brings us to the uh, graphics code. Update screen is in GR screen at the bottom. This is the main routine called by the window manager. He, the window manager paints the screen 30 times a second. Anyway, uh, if you're in text mode, it does a slightly different thing. You're almost never, in, don't worry, text mode um, is not normal. Anyway, uh, so it updates the background to text, it updates the foreground to text, then it calls, then it updates all the window documents, renders all the window documents, then it, uh, each, each window has a document for the text, a border document and a main document. And it can be double buffered, but anyway, uh, so th this is the routine we're going to look at. Update windows. So this goes through all the tasks on core zero. Only core zero. Only core zero can have windows. And it uh, since the user since the user is allowed to fudge around with tasks, we have to validate that the user didn't do something. A little kid could put a crayon in the blender or something. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, uh, so we check to see if the task is valid. That's kind of a... Normally you wouldn't have that, but since we allow users to mess with system stuff, makes it a little more robust in theory. Although if it fails, it probably fails fatally. It's probably fatal. <laughs> anyway, uh, so uh, um, if it's the... That's a special case. It was a window manager. Otherwise, it updates the documents, like I told you, and it uh, it calls the uh, draw it callback. Six, 30 times a second, each task has an option of drawing some graphics. That's the draw it callback. Now, uh, I tried to make a picture of um, how graphics are rendered. It's kind of uh, so graphic overview. So if you look up here, um, the text we saw where it did the foreground and background, uh, it lags a refresh. Now, so every when it updates the documents, that writes to the text layer. I think it actually, and it, it kind of uh, it lags a refresh on the text, but on the but if you put graphics in your draw it or in your document, they're 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 not lagging. That's kind of a uh, a uh, min minor point or something. Anyway, uh, so it goes through all the tasks. We saw where it goes through all the tasks. It renders the documents to the text layer. Then it calls the draw it routine. Then it draws controls. Uh, you see this little square down here? I don't know if you can see. Uh, how about over here? No, we can't. None of them are active. Um, hold on a second. 
the, I'm grabbing the scroll bar. Uh, the scroll bar that is a control, um, and uh, so it draws the control for each task. And uh, finally, there's a persistent layer, which is uh, if we're at the command line and we say gr circle. Now the persistent layer is the default. 100, 100, 100. That's the persistent layer. Anyway, so uh, uh, I don't know what else you want to know. You can, uh, the th I can maybe do a video on the 3D support. Um, in a device context, we uh, we uh, we have some automatic projecting using a matrix four by four. Um, anyway, uh, so yeah, there is some three D code in the graphics routines. Um, there's a two D version and there's a three D version of most things. Anyway, so. Uh, That'll get you started. Uh, what else was there in the Atom directory? Uh, the utilities, there's a grep, a diff, file manager. That's an, There's a some bitmap files for Windows support. Memrep is a nice utility. I never use it, honestly. In theory, it's nice. I don't know. I, I never use it. <laughs> there's a check disk. There's um, profiler's nice. I, I have a spaces to tabs. I run that. Um, my uh, if you make a string uh, in your code, you might want to use shift space so that you can use spaces to tab. My tabs are always eight characters. This will render HTML with syntax highlighting. You can convert one of my documents to plain text. Uh, the sound routines, graphics, the the God stuff, the Bible and stuff like that. Uh, what else we have? The document framework, uh, controls. That's what I. That's the scroll bar and stuff like that. It could be expanded. We really we have a, a slider, and we have buttons. That's about it. I don't really find I need them anyway, but you might want them. So we could maybe, maybe, oh, I was going to talk about gentrification. Uh, anyway, uh, yeah, the main, the only thing that really needs a, a new th algorithm is uh, updating documents. We have a widget that lets you move the cursor. Um, let me just show you some of the document features. Uh, cursor movement. So if you say, if we give a command to move the cursor four lines down, minus, or anyway. We just, we just, uh, we drew ten lines and then we, we came up. What is going to bird? So uh, you can; these are done in order. So it moves the cursor over to draw different columns. Sometimes, in theory, that might be nice. I don't really do anything. That... Actually, the uh, you can move to the center of the window. The borders are done with uh, cursor movements. That's actually a document with cursor movements. Um, I can show you some of the features. Uh, well, anyway, so the problem is. Uh, since we can move the cursor, we have to redraw everything from the entire document um, 30 times a second, which uh, normally is not a big deal. We idle at about 5%, I don't know. But if we're inside of uh, the Bible, then uh, we have pretty crappy performance and flashing and stuff. Um, but uh, let me, let me, um, anyway, so uh, maybe if, if Nuth wants to, 
think about how, how to you can layer let me just show you what what it's capable of that I'm gonna go to uh, the Bible's a hundred thousand lines we're gonna go to line 50,000 and then what we're gonna do is move the cursor back 50,000 and over we're gonna do a, a, a shut up bird so we're gonna do control L and uh, we're gonna do a margin page setting left margin let's say 40 oops control T okay so uh, I just moved over now what I'm gonna do is uh, uh, I'll just move up uh, a little bit uh, control L cursor movement just so you can see shut up bird the bird wants down anyway uh, so shut up bird minus 20 so if you see what I did there I'm sorry the bird needs help the bird needs. okay so if you see what I did there uh, I moved the uh, cursor so this feature is maybe maybe I should get rid of this feature but I, I need it to some extent in theory you could move 50,000 lines no I can do that I can do I can do that right now as a matter of fact I can move uh, let's do another control L page setting left margin let's go 60 and uh, let's control L Cursor movement, let's go uh, minus 40,000. So now we're uh, at 40,000. Is it going to do it? There, at 40,000, we have that. So uh, that's, we have, uh, um, so somehow it would be nice if we could speed that up um so i don't know i probably shouldn't say anything because there's probably not a there's no answer that i would like i just like it would just live with it it's i don't want something really complicated um i have a um i was gonna make a rule rule you can only remove lines of code we don't want any additions we just want removal um, and uh, I would like to give news dollars um, <laughs> not news dollars anyway uh, let's see what God says so uh, let's get alt shift let's do a hold on a second alt shift F7 God says all things that he had done and Isaac brought her into his mother Sarah's tent and took Rebecca and she became his wife and he loved her and Isaac was comforted after his mother's death then again Abraham took a wife and her name was Keturah and she bare him Simran Joke Sean and Medan and Median and Ishbak and Shua Joke Sean begat Sheba Dedan and sons of Dedan were Ashuram, let us him, and Lim. Let us him, that's like lettuce code. <laughs> Bulky and low calories. I think that's what it is. Anyway, uh, I've seen some places where you have lettuce code. <laughs> Not in my operating system. Anyway, uh, oh well.